Hi everyone, I'm Michelle Bailey with Cool Springs Plastic Surgery. I'm a registered nurse injector. I've been with Dr. Moore a long time and uh, today we're going to show you tear trough filler. Uh, a lot of women ask about it. They'll come in saying they look tired or they have hollowing underneath or dark circles and it's really good for all the above. Now I tell patients that if you have eye swelling or have a lot of problems with allergies, you may not be a good candidate for it. So we really do need to consult with you ahead of time to see if you're a candidate for it or not. The things that we tell our patients are the uh, procedure really is relatively comfortable, believe it or not. You would think in the eye area that it'd be a little uncomfortable, but it's not bad at all. Um, we have our patients watch for excessive swelling or any color changes after their filler, and uh, basically they do great with it. Um, if you're not a candidate for tear trough filler, sometimes you're a candidate for eye surgery. So I tell patients, just if you're not sure, come on in, let us take a look at you and consult with you and uh, give, you, give you our advice on it. Now I've got a patient that is in here that's ready to go. She's already been numbed. We typically numb you there. And uh, she has been told all the risk and complications and we're ready to watch inject. So follow me. Hi, Miss Jamie. Hello. And we're gonna go ahead and get started. Feeling kind of numb, or it's kind of hard to tell in that area. Hard to tell. A little bit. So, as you can see, we've already numbed her. So we're gonna go ahead and uh, at least get one side done today. Uh, uh, during our filming, we will definitely do both sides before she leaves. But for time's sake, we may only do one for the camera. All right, and that should feel kind of like a little, little weird yes. feeling. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely. All right, and we're going to clean you off with some antiseptic. So look up for me. There we go. Good job. All right. And get it good and dry. Now we're going to be using a cannula for injection there. Cannula is much softer than a needle and less swelling and less trauma to the area. So, um, Jamie, relax your cheeks for me and then I want you to close your eyes for a minute. There we go. I'm going to measure and you're going to feel me touch you. Okay. And I will warn you before we do any sticks or anything. Okay. Very good. All right. And a little stick. Great job. How was that? It should have been like a two on a one to 10 scale or less. Not bad at all. Great. All right, and here's where I want you to tell me if you have any discomfort or pain. Pressure. Pressure? Okay, pressure's normal. Perfect. And we are beautifully placed. So I'm going to pull back, so make sure we don't, aren't in a vessel or an artery. And you're going to feel a little pressure there. Should not be having any pain. Beautiful. Doing good. How are we feeling? Totally fine. All right. I don't really feel good job. Right and look up for me, open. Great. And as you can tell, it's already filled that um, hollow there. Great. And look up for me, like all the way up. Great. And relax. And you can see the difference between the two sides already, um, how she's filled out through here, and it's not as dark. She doesn't have that darkness that she had there a minute ago. So we just kind of massage the area through here. And with her, she's got a little bit of hollowing over here, so I'm going to go in here next and do this area, um, give her a little bit through there. So you doing okay, Miss Jamie? Mm -hmm. All right. And just relax. I'm going to measure here. Jamie doesn't have a lot of um, swelling or issues with 
with that kind of thing. So she's a great candidate. Now, as you notice, she's very dark complected. And darker complected people can be kind of tricky because sometimes they will present with um, a dark area there and a lot of it can be um, actually discoloration of the skin. With her, she's got a little discoloration, but not bad at all. And how are we doing, Jamie? <laughs> You're cracking up because camera's in your face, I'm sure. And relax that chin. There we go. Beautiful. Great. And then we just kind of massage to make sure it's nice and smooth. Great. And sometimes you'll get a little tiny bruise right where the insertion site is, but um, she's really not going to have any bruising except maybe this one spot, tiny, tiny. And I'm going to show her. And what do you think? Looks good. Yep. Yeah, and see, we put a little bit in here too. Awesome. <laughs> that's great. So that's got yeah, one, one side done. And I'm going to hold a little pressure here just so she doesn't get any bruising here. So you had no pain? Mm -mm. See, it's relatively, relatively easy to do. And um, I do caution you, please, please, if you get tear troughs done, go to an experienced injector. You want to know how, you know, how long they've been doing it, how many they've done. You really, this is an area that can be dangerous. So you do not want to go to somebody that doesn't have experience in this area. Very good. Did great. All right, and we're ready to do the other side. Thank you for watching. We've really enjoyed doing this, and as you can see, it's not that pain and painful at all and uh, pretty easy to do. So you guys have a great day, and uh, give us a call.